welcome back to a frugal vlog travel day um day yeah it's friday and i am on my way to cambodia um the day started off with a hour-long taxi ride and i'm now waiting for the bus for giant ibis or ibis or i think it's ibis um it's a company that i'm using to get through to cambodia um bus leaves at 9 a.m I left at 7 a.m., uh, so it's around 8.30. So it's been, yeah, busy morning already, but I'm excited to get going. And uh, yeah, I'll bring you guys along once I'm on the bus. Oh, well, so far, so good. Um, not even nine o'clock yet. Yeah. It's 12 minutes left. Um, came over, grabbed us, took us over to the bus, got us all situated. Seats are exceptionally comfortable, very relaxed. Um, I'm going to be speaking quiet, obviously, because of people here. But uh, they collected my passport information and we're good. Um, very comfortable. Air conditioning was on. And uh, everyone's been very polite. So, so far, so good. So far, so good. Uh, it's closing in on 1 p.m. We are just closing in on the Cambodia-Thailand border. Uh, consulates behind me, they are getting our visas. Uh, I have to admit, so far, this has been great. Uh, the service has been wonderful. They have, uh, it was coffee. You know, it was a can of coffee and a, and a muffin or a croissant this morning. Uh, they had one bathroom break for 10 minutes earlier. This is their second one. And uh, yeah, they've been great. Uh, the one thing that we had an option for that I didn't know about before was I was informed it was uh, $35 US plus $5 fee from the company. Um, so I thought it was only in US dollars. But when we were here, uh, they mentioned that, yeah, you could pay in Thai baht. So it was 1400 baht. So that was something that I didn't know beforehand. So since I wanted to try to keep a hold of my U.S. money, I was like, okay, I'll pay in bot. And I saved, I think, like about two bucks or something like that, Canadian, when I did a quick tra uh, conversion on it. So, but yeah, uh, just going to wait and then get into Cambodia. I think this is like another two hours once we are in to get to Siem Reap. They said anywhere between four and five, depending on uh, traffic. I hope it's closer to four because I need to get a SIM card for my phone and the place I was looking at closes at 5.30 and it's a 20 minute walk from the bus station. So I was like, oh, and the hotel is a 23 minute walk from the bus station. So either way, I will be in, in a good time. Okay, well, made it to Cambodia. Uh, I'm going to say that was stupid, stupid easy. Um, I chatted with Meng, uh, he was the host that helped us get it through. Um, yeah, it was uh, 1400 baht, 40 bucks US. Processed everything that I needed. Uh, I wasn't able to film anything when I was in because it's, uh, they don't allow for pictures, which I absolutely understand. And I didn't, I didn't even plan and try to do anything. Uh, so you get off the bus, they give you these lanyards in case there's any trouble. Uh, and then they say that you have, um, you, you go through one line, you go and kind of leave Thailand. So they, you know, sign your passport, you're done. And then you go through a walkway, climb up some stairs and you wait in line. It was uh, not terribly busy, busy enough. I think it was like about 20 minute wait to go through the line to get out. Um, but, you know, everything that they said that they were going to do, they did. So the visa process was simple. Getting in was simple. Um, I was chatting with Meng when I was uh, when I got down because he was directing me over here towards the bus, and I asked him about getting a SIM card. And immediately, some women came up because they were trying to sell SIM cards, and he said, "No, no, no, just go ahead and get it in town." So I understood that it was a little bit expensive, and, and I'm fine with that. Um, I think they were trying to charge me five bucks for a week, 
where it's around 150 I think. I don't know. Because I was looking at six bucks for a month. So, which I'm going to probably get when I get into Seam Reap. But yeah, uh, I'm going to pause until we get over there. This has been fun. And it's a long day. Long day. I'm here. I have made it. Good see him reap. <laughs> it was a long day. Not gonna lie. Um, giant Evis, though. Excellent job. Uh, no complaints with the service or anything at all. Uh, I think they told us initially it would be in at 5:30. Um, you can get in just after five. So I'm gonna try to rush and get to a. Uh, cell phone store and see if I can get a cell phone set up for today. If not, I'll do it tomorrow and I'll just head over to the, to the, uh, the hotel <laughs> otherwise. Yeah, they gave us a can of coffee and uh, a croissant this morning. Um, and then at, after we came across the border, uh, we were given a um, bottle of water and a uh, thing of fried rice. The, I ate the uh, fried rice, it was nice, it was lovely. And uh, yeah, I am going to uh, hopefully get a cell phone. Well, I'll, I'll let you guys know once I find out more. Good morning. Uh, thought I'm gonna do a quick room tour. I was going to do this last night, but I was so tired when I got back. I was just like, no, no. Plus I wanted to give the room its fair share a shake. So uh, yeah, let's do this real quick bed so you come in this door you know i got my computer all set up we're all set for editing i actually edited the first part of this vlog already uh twin bed single whatever you want to call it uh soft comfortable clean everything was good uh the windows are open this is a fan room as you can see so there is no ac in this room i think it got down to like 21 last night so very comfortable um you got like a wet bathroom or the wet room. So you get your sink with the shower over top and toilet with the bone gun and everything works out nice. And over here, I got like a little wardrobe thing so I get my clothes and whatnot and there's me. So yeah, uh, I don't have a complaint. Uh, the room, $8 Canadian a night. So when you put that into perspective, that's very reasonable. It works really well. Um, I'm going to show you some of the other stuff that's out here, too. Um, I'm very pleased with this. Uh, so far, like, just my first 12 hours in Siem Reap has been lovely. The colors here are wild. Uh, so I'm up on the balcony, and uh, I'll show you guys. This is pretty cool. There's a hammock. Oh, that's coming in. Yeah, nice little view. Nothing to complain about. But there's like this lovely little seating area surrounded by all the greenery. And this is on each of the floors here. It's just gorgeous. I'm digging it. I'm digging the Seam Reap a lot. So, I will end things here. That was a fun adventure. Uh, I really enjoyed my... Uh, my travels here, not gonna lie. It was a, it was a fun trip. Um, company I went with, Giant Ibis, phenomenal. Um, yeah, the process of getting here uh, from Bangkok was just simple. I'm going to go off and find breakfast and enjoy the city. You guys will see that in your next video. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you are new and you wanna see more content like this, feel free to subscribe, like, share, comment. There'll be a video over here. You want to see some of my other content. Anyway, I'll see you guys soon. Take care, bud.